Umar Ahmed, IFL TV, MTK Global. Haroon's just pulled me into the dressing room. Jake, how did you get on tonight? Yeah, one well on points. Pissed it off, kids. Yeah? Yeah. Haroon, firstly I'll come to you. Um, your word on, on your man's performance well, tonight? Well, this is, this is Jake James. Um, a lot, of, a lot of people know him up and down the country from the amateur days, top amateur international, boxed for England plenty of times, won many things as an amateur. Uh, this was his third, his fourth pro fight tonight, but his first one under heavy hitters. Um, so basically it was like, um, he's been out since June. Uh, it was like a debut tonight. Uh, we got given a tough opponent with a winning record. Okay. You know what I mean? We could have picked a softer tomato can, but we didn't. We went with it. And uh, the kid came to win, like he does. He's, he slipped up a few top prospects in the likes of, say, a Matthew Rennie, people like that. He slipped them up. So uh, we had him for our first our first meal together, you know what I mean? So, you know, he's um, Jake done well tonight. Um, the referee scored it tight, but, uh, you know, everyone watching it was, it was Did he get it? 38, 37. He gave it 38, 37, but I had it like, the kid had a point, so it was like 40, 35. Easy, you know what I mean? But it is what it is, it's a win. It's the first one, it's positive for the team. And, uh, you know, he's got a, got a bright future, Jake, you know what I mean? Really, really bright. Um, he'll come down to like well off. Okay. Um, dominate, you know what I mean? So. When did this uh, link up come about, Jake? Um, just around, just after Christmas. Um, seen Haroon about, um, moved over. Did a, lot of, did a little bit of him and loved it. Yeah, yeah, yeah really, really jolled well with him. Do you many tickets tonight? <laughs> Done about 100 tickets. Okay. Yeah. Where are you from? From around there, Fieldsworth, all them. Oh, right. Yeah. All right. So, what's it like working with this man? I know it's only been a, a short while. But you know, you know what, right? It, as you know, you know, I've worked with many a welterweight now. You know, and uh, it's like um, it's a division no well. There's a trainer now, welter like welter. And if you look in the gym where I have, you know, there's, there's a lot of talent in there and the likes of Jake has been getting some good work with Atif Shafiq, who's with me now. You know, he's left the Ingle gym. He's, he's in with us and, and that's been the education he's getting. So he's going to pull some clay off him and, and come through and, you know, um, start travelling around a little bit more, getting some sparring with the likes of the Terry Flanagan's and the people okay. that are. It's all available and yeah. he'll, he'll just learn. It's a process, but um, like you say, tonight, you know, I was really happy with him. You know, I'm not really going to pull out too much of a, a critique on it, you know, so to speak. You know what I mean? You like that way. How has it been in a ring with uh, Terry Flanagan? Oh, I've not spied him yet, but... Have you not? No, 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 but... Um, you see now, Coogan would have been a bit soon. more sharper on that one there. If you <laughs> well, I thought you said he's been in the ring with him. No, I said we're going to get him. Oh, we're going to get him. Sorry, yeah, my bad. To, my bad. You know, what about Atif? How's that been? Yeah, he's good, he's good at Atif. I learn a lot from him. You know, he sets things up and then he'll catch you with a shot and you think, you know, that's how he did it, do you know what I mean? And then you, you try it on other people and you, you soak things up off him, but yeah, he's a top, top kid. Okay. What's the plan for you for this year anyways, Jake? Um, well, I've had four now, so I just need to keep busy this year and sort of knock on for some minor titles, like a central area title or something next year. Right. I'll have a busy year now. All right. Yeah. Jake, Haroon? So, how come you don't go Philadelphia? <laughs> you, the, 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 the expenses don't cover you. Possibly not. Come on, speak your mind. I'm going to New York you're soon. You're always slacking off when, when he's not. Nice. What? <laughs> <laughs> that is not true. You're going to edit that out, you know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> no, I'll keep it in, I'll keep it in. I'm going to New York soon, though. Oh, you're going to New York? What's going on Crawford, there? Crawford Khan. Are you going to that? Yeah, he's doing uh, okay. the O2 bill. I'm, I'm doing that, so... Coogan's yeah. stepped aside for that. Well, we've wow. got Chisora and Dave Allen on that bill, so that's... Oh, these boys, viewed, innit? Yeah. yeah. These boys, innit? I'm not complaining, though. It's all right. These boys, man. <laughs> eh? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, Jake, anything Listen, you'd like to add? Haroon, anything you'd like to add? I'd like to add that, um, you know, um, this boxing's hard and, you know, like you say, you've come down here. It's not always glamorous, you know. It's the small hall circuits that make many a great champion, you know what I mean? And it's good that IFL have come down here and supported that. You know, rather than just turn up at the O2 where it's all nice, you can stay in the in a car uh. and eat your prawn sandwiches. You know what I mean? So, <laughs> so it's good that you come down to the small hall circuit, and you know you support the growth of what's coming through because not every every lad starts off with the glamour. You know what I mean? Some kids have to earn their way, and like say the likes of the, the Terry Flanders, and Josh Warrington, they've come from the hustle of the small hall and become great champions. Jack Catterall, they've come from the small hall hustle and then they come into the lights. You know what I mean? So it's good that you know you've come down and seen that and. You know, the likes of Jake and that, they're the, they're the kids that are going to hustle and come through and come out of that barrel, you know what I mean? So, um, 
respect for the interview. No problem. It's uh, first time in Oldham. First time in Oldham? Yeah. Is this where we are, Oldham? Oldham, yeah. This is Oldham, isn't it? Oldham. Yeah. <laughs> Oldham Legends. <laughs> United fan? City fan. Oh, okay. United. What was the score? Well, last time I checked, Wolves were 2 0 up against oh, United. Oh, stop it, man. You got lucky today, though. 3 2. Nah, but it was offside that was last it? goal. Oh, that's you know, that's you know. The second goal yeah. went a pen, but. Make your own luck. Anyways. <laughs> 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 All right, Jake, Haroon. Nice Thanks for your time. Respect, Thank you. Thank you.